Good morning, Millie. What's up, puppy? Ben, what's up, buddy? You guys wanna go outside? Let's go outside, come on. Nothing like a little puppy ASMR in the morning, am I right? How's it going, folks? Welcome back to an episode of Fisher Flare today. It's early in the morning. Well, not super early. It's like seven. Just woke up. You can tell. I look like a bag of Winkies. But I'm looking for some deer. I don't see any deer today. I saw some last night, right before I was going to bed. I saw one right up there. But I'm not seeing one today. Seems like the longer I've lived here, the more nocturnal the deer are getting. They're getting used to... Well, they're not getting used to us. They're getting... They know that we're here, and they go out at night. Basically, the freaking dogs bark at them. You know, if I was a deer and I had a dog barking at me, I wouldn't hang out in the, during the day either. So, anyways, dogs are fed. Dogs have water. We need to go check on the chickens. Woo! How's it going, folks? We made it down to the chicken coop. Good morning, chickens. How you doing, chickens? Oh, that's good. Good to hear it. What's up, buddy? How you doing? You guys just chilling? All right, one, two, three, four, five. Where's the fifth, where's the sixth one? Uh-oh, might've had our first casualty. Oh, just kidding, it's in there. Well, folks, we have yet to have any eggs. It's been like two days. Uh, I know it's like a lot of chickens take time to get acclimated, but I think it's been enough time. They've had food, they've had water, we haven't really messed with them. Look at them, they're just living their best life out here, just scratching. So, really hoping, fingers crossed, we got eggs. Moment of truth. Do we have any? We have one. We have one. One little brown one. What's up, Junior? I was hoping for a little bit more excitement than that. But hey, we got one egg. The first egg so far that these little suckers have laid. So, you gotta start somewhere, I guess. I think I should give these guys some millworms, though. They love those little things. Oh, look, they know. Get your little wormies. Here's your little morning snack. First you get puppy ASMR, now you get chicken ASMR. What more could you ask for? Anyways, chickens are taken care of. I let them kind of like just do their free ranging kind of thing right here. They they really don't, the last couple of days, they haven't really free ranged much. Like they'll, they'll come peck around and then they just like go back in their coop. And I have not, fingers crossed, knock on wood, I've not had any issues yet with foxes or coyotes or hawks i've not had any issues uh with letting them out or leaving the door open i do need some like electric netting or some fencing around here i'm working on it but i am going to leave these guys just chilling just doing their thing here for a little bit just this morning and i'll come back and maybe lock them up but yeah i do need to get some fencing around here so they have more play space but i've been letting them out every day coming back at night locking them up they're still alive so we're still good to go anyways we're heading back up to the house I gotta get my morning coffee in. Fun fact for the day, well I've got two of them. Free range coffee makes you catch twice as many fish, shoot twice as many ducks, kill twice as big of deer, and tastes freaking amazing. Your other fun fact, well that was kind of four, so we're going on five, is life hack for you. If you got a Keurig like me and you're using a K-cup, like a free range K-cup like I did today, and you want to have the coffee ready to drink right away, hit the ice button. It comes out at like the perfect drinking temperature. It's just a life hack of mine. I, no one told me it, just discovered it on my own, accidentally hit it one day, drank it, and I was like, wow, this does not burn my entire throat. This is pretty neat. So if, obviously if you want coffee to put in a thermos to go hunting or fishing, or you want it to be really hot for a long time, or if you just like burning your tongue all the time, no, don't do it. But if you want to like make a cup of coffee and then immediately grab it and drink it, and have it be the perfect temperature, hit the ice button on your Keurig. Well, at least my Keurig works that way. I don't, maybe yours comes out freezing cold or something, like a Frappuccino or something. Finn, what are you doing? You guys tearing it up back there or what? Millie! <laughs> there she is. Come here, man! Come here, Millie! What you guys doing? You guys chasing deer around? Yeah, you guys keeping them away, I'm sure. That's good for it. Anyways, those are your fun facts for the day. If you guys wanna go check out Free Range Coffee, I'll leave it down below. We got K-Cups, Duck Blind Roast, Freedom Roast, everything that you need. The best tasting coffee ever. Look what the cat drug in. Sheesh, all three of you boys. How you guys doing? Killing the game? You killing the game? Yes, sir. You have stomach issues. Yes, sir. That was a bad deal. A buddy came to my house and just absolutely dropped bombs. Bonzo! How you do this thing, mister? You pull that back and you 
You give that a twerk. Well, we just, I, I forgot to vlog, sorry. We threw uh, peaches and lettuce inside there. Organic, it was just lettuce that kind of went old and a peach that Macy said wasn't that good, but they're hanging out. We've got one egg. I got the first egg this morning. Really? They've got some improvement, improvement to do, improving to do. We should be getting six eggs a day. So far we've gotten one in the course of like three days, but at least one of them's laying eggs. I guess you should check again, it's been like an hour. No eggs. No. Not a interesting. No, they might just be they might just be taking their time. Yeah. I mean, takes take some time for them to kind of get acclimated and whatever. But anyways, if you guys have any tips for making them lay more eggs or something, let me know. Sprinkle something on them or do something. I think you just got to make sure they have food and water, right? I mean, I don't know if there's any more else to it. But if you guys have any tips, let me know. But what are we doing today, boys? What's the mission? The marketplace mission part two. This one's a roadie. We gotta drive four hours. When I was sitting there. Sipping on my free range coffee, ripping on Facebook Marketplace, the place that I should never be on. <sighs> I found something I could not live without. I'm sorry, I, I just, I can't. I can't s stop, okay? When there's something that cool, you just, you have to have it. And so I, I, I emailed the dude or messaged the dude and asked if it's still available. It was, got the price way down from what he listed at to the point where Bonzo basically just is forcing me to go buy this thing at this point. Isn't that right, Bonzo? It'd be dumb if you didn't go get it. What if it doesn't work? It's from, is it 1987? 86. 86? Yeah. It's, it's like a homemade, um, well, you guys will see. It's, it's a 12 wheeled ATV. Okay, yeah, you heard it, 12. Didn't know it was a thing, it's a thing. Built in the 1980s, I think somebody literally just made it in their garage one day. I don't know if this thing's gonna run, but it is four hours away. And the boys, we're gonna load up in the truck and head out there and see see what we can get, I don't know. I think it's just a, a better bet just to sit here with my chickens and hang out for the day instead of spend a bunch of money on something that may or may not work. What if we get there and it like doesn't work? I mean, we just drove four hours for no reason. You gotta risk it for the biscuit, huh? Yep, that, that's, the, that's, that's the saying. That's the saying for life, huh? Yep. If we do buy this, what's the first thing we should do with it? Jump it into the pond. Yeah. Make a ramp for it. Is Slayman the one gonna be the one driving it though? If you guys want to die. All right. Well, <laughs> I, my vote Slayman goes first. Stay tuned. Uh, what are you, are you voting for, Slayman? Slayman. Okay. 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 All right. Well, so you guys get to watch Slayman die. You guys stay tuned. Well, it's not that. That's a lawnmower. Well, it's missing like freaking eight wheels. Oh my God! Look at that thing. Dude. I think you can squeeze two guys in that. Oh yeah, we can. Oh my god, this Dude, is... that engine is huge. Oh god, yeah, definitely put the camera down for now. Yeah. We'll uh, we'll catch up with you guys once I buy it. You never know, these guys are kind of... Everyone has guns around here and you start filming, the people get worried, so I'll see you guys in a bit. I don't even know what to say, dude. Wow. Do you have buyer's remorse or is it just me? No, I'm, I'm You think it's a good idea? Oh, great idea. What do, you, do you think it might it's... be your best purchase yet? I don't think so, dude. I, I don't do you... know, you guys I'm... making it sound sketch. He's making it sound like, okay, so just for perspective, I messaged this guy on Facebook and he told me there's nothing wrong with it. And we get here and he had a list of things that were wrong with it. And so I talked him down a lot. I mean, I got it for like almost half what they were listing it for, which is good. But I feel like this is one of those things where we're going to use it twice and it's going to break and I'm, we're just never going to touch it again. Possibly. Or we're just going to use it every day. I don't think we're, we're going to use it every day. <laughs> I think this thing is, uh, well, the odds it stays on the trailer for one is not very high. Honestly, the only reason why I bought it after there's issues and I can tell you right now, that's just not a good investment. Okay. Kids that you're watching, don't spend your money on these things, but no one has this. Nope. I promise you, I think, I promise you that I'm the only person on YouTube that has this. I think I haven't really looked that hard, but like, I've never, like I Googled it and you can't find it. Like I, there's literally only one that we've been able to find and I, I was able to buy it today. So anyways. We're headed back. We got like a four hour drive home and see if we can make this thing run and see if Bonzo crashes. You guys stay tuned. Shoo! Well folks, we made it to the farm. We brought it down to the farm, not my house. The farm seemed a little bit more suitable. If we get this thing stuck in the water or something, we have another tank amphibious vehicle that can help us pull us out. So anyways, we gotta get the sucker off the trailer. This should be interesting. You guys stay tuned. On your gear. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go over honestly, like over the top. Yeah. Yeah. Um, okay. how do you work this thing, mister? So it's in neutral now. Yeah, that. Did that go forward? Yeah, it definitely was going forward. Nice. This reminds me way too much of the moped. Yep. Yeah, well, why does everything I buy not work when I get home? <sighs> this ain't working. Ready? Yep. One more. I feel like I'm gonna fall. <laughs> Yay! There you go. Nope. Why does this 
this always happen? Kill switch. It was a kill switch. He never told us about he that. He never told us about that. How do you go forward in this thing? Just it just goes like like it pretty much just goes. It's just throttled and then, and then like and turn you turn like that. But you would think that would be reverse. Yeah. Because it should turn. Yeah, that's how it's skipping. Why don't we just like try to get it out so I've got room to okay. mess with it? I mean, who knows? I'll you might call, have to pull I'll that. Call, I'll call Rick and ask him if there's a yeah. reverse on this thing. Hello. Hey, this is Andrew Flair. How are you? Hey, quick question on this thing. Is there a reverse? You know? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I wasn't, I don't know, like, for some reason I thought if you just pulled back on the sticks it went backwards, but we're not finding that to be the case. I think it's the one with the rubber handle. Oh, down below? Yeah, like down on the floor. Oh, that's probably it then, yeah. There's 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 something down there. So it's this thing, should we just try to like yeah. get it? So how does this work? Pull it towards me. Don't really pull anything. Okay, so that pin, can you move that thing? There's no way to there, there's no. no No, there's like it don't it, it goes in and out, the pin. But then it stops right there. Should we just rip it in for in front and just figure out reverse later? Yeah. Yeah. It always seems I just have the greatest investments ever when I'm on Facebook Marketplace. Marketplace mission. This dope series that we're starting probably should come to an end after today. But hey, this ain't the end of the video. We actually realize we don't have any plugs for this. You gotta plug this. The thing floats. I mean, it's supposed, supposed to float. Slayman's off on plug duty. He's off on plug duty right now. Gonna go get plugs. And Bonzo, John, and I are gonna drive this thing around and get used to it. Hopefully not crash. And uh, hopefully not get in a position where we have to use reverse. Because that's not possible. <laughs> so uh, wish us luck. <laughs> Just try to rip. I did. Now it's ripping? Yeah. Oh, geez. Dude, there's a reason he only showed us first gear. Yeah, why did he only stay in first gear? Because the rest don't work. Just get bamboozled. You know, you try to do things in life, sometimes they just, just don't go as planned. Like spending several thousands of dollars on something that doesn't work. What, do, what does one do with this thing? That goes like two miles an hour. It like, literally goes like two miles an hour. He's like, oh, this goes like 15 miles an hour. Yeah, he said it ripped. It ain't ripping, Rick. I mean, I don't think I'm doing anything wrong. I mean, I'm trying to shift, not well, but I'm trying. I mean, it's getting into higher gear, but like your speed is still like not there. And your throttle's like, that's the absolute throttle I've ever seen. Oh, it's bad. Like, I wasn't touching anything and it was like... Two miles an hour, you can't do much. You can't do much. I could ride a bike faster than this. I know. I feel like we need to like take it in somewhere, but it's gonna end up costing me so much. I feel like it's gonna cost more to fix it than it is what I got it for. There's a reason why he sold it cheap. Facebook Marketplace mission.
Those are bad ideas. I don't know. Should I just keep ripping it and see if the thing explodes, starts on fire? At least we'll have a good thumbnail or something. You want to try to drive it and see if you can figure it out? I mean, sure. I'm Maybe not Bonzo's it, used to ride dirt bikes. Well, all right, all right. We'll, we'll let Bonzo get the sticks and see what happens. does that you think the throttle's broken this has to move with it yeah so watch this gold piece like sometimes it just like stayed up like that. gotcha so maybe just see some wd-40 or is it be, is it beyond wd-40 duty you were doing what did you do that you you started flying for a second yeah i, go, I got to third gear okay and then it, and then so, what happened and then this just like crapped out so the guy said that they redid the carburetor but it needs tuned and it's missing don't know what that means but does it have does that have to do with your shifting I sort of know what that means. And Dude, I don't if you're a mechanic and have nothing better to do with your life than to come hang out with a bunch of idiots, there's an application that you can fill out. It'll be linked down below. You can come have a job here at the Flair Farm for zero dollars and zero cents per hour and teach us what the hell is going on. We don't know what we're doing here. Yeah, you can be in the vlogs. I, we Seriously, we need somebody that knows. Like, I keep buying things and doing things and no one here knows what's going on and we just are hopeless. We need someone's help. If you guys are a mechanic, comment down below. This is a, like a, I don't even know what year. It's a Nighthawk, a Honda engine. What's going on? Why ain't this thing freaking scooting? Let me know what you guys think, but I just want Slam to get here so we can go throw this in the water and then kill it and then just leave it there for a lawn ornament. Like a really expensive lawn ornament. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna get back in. Actually, John, John needs to drive this thing. Dude, you got this, Bonzo's got this. Got this. Like he, you had some- Bonzo's way better, better than me at it. I'll tell you that much. Bonzo, he's the closest thing to a freaking NASCAR driver here. And he's not that close, but he's a lot closer than me. You use a manual car? No. Never. No. You've never done stick. No. That's oh God. That's the problem. Oh God. That's all I was trying to tell you. Okay, you got no. This. It's fine. It's fine. So when you push the clutch, you're oh. in neutral. So, so go everything push goes in. wrong. Go ahead and push that in. That's just in, push okay? the clutch. If you're trying to get in the second, third, and fourth, uh, like while you're driving, push your yep. foot in on that. And you'll be in neutral. And then you're gonna push back on this. Okay. So it's gonna be up here. Right. You're gonna push it back, and then that second, third, fourth yeah. is what. And you when push. you when you like push back, once it's back, then you let off the clutch. Yep. And then okay. it's there. Yep. Oh, okay. So, so you have to stay so, throttling it. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> good you yeah. did really good I think, I think it's a throttle I issue i think i think it's a throttle issue for sure yeah you ride next to me <laughs> yeah you want to drive you can stand right there it's not like we go very fast i was walking faster than john was going he was going full throttle <laughs> this thing sucks you ready for this moment bonzo oh yeah <laughs> take two bonzo you ready for this moment oh yeah This thing sounds terrible. Okay. You can hear it misfiring. Yeah. It's like boom, 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 and it like misses. Yeah. Dude, I, we, did you hear it? those were bad sounds? Dude, it was when you were turning, it's not like turning. my way, like something, something was like on breaking your side, on my something side. Inside, it definitely broke. There's a lot of problems. It's not one thing. It's like ten this things. This is gonna be a money pit if I try to get this thing up and running. I feel like I have to get up and running. Worth though. it, dude. If this thing rips like forty miles Imagine an hour, imagine if thing actually works. We just gotta fix it somehow. We need slamming. We just need to take it in the water and see if it floats. Promote some merch so you get money. Oh, true. If you get no, that's that's sleazy. <laughs> Don't do that, Bonzo. <laughs> always, always plug. <laughs> always plug. No, you can leave all that. In. That's funny. All right, just I guess I'll just sit here and for slamming. How'd that go? Good. Still works. You didn't hit anything. Nope. Almost died a couple times. Did you? Yeah, if it makes you feel any better, this thing still sucks. Yeah. Yeah, we got it ripping for like three seconds, and then it just kind of like puts. Like we can run it. No reverse. There's no reverse, and like we got a little fast. Like we'll shift, and then it goes fast, and then it just like stops. It's a bash. We got a plug. Should we just should we just sink it in the marsh and just call it a day? Are we pause. There's only one hole here, boys. <laughs> can you put over? Dad, I can't. Oh, jeez. Now it really ain't working. 
I don't say this could make a good lawn ornament. She's dead. She's dead. She's dead. I think we could push her onto your property, though. This hey. might have been the biggest botch in like a long time. I mean, I'm full of botches, but what the? Well, I guess um, let's just uh, push it onto the grass and come back. I guess. Ready? Good enough for now. Oh, we're leaving her for the birds. I don't really care. If any guys want this job, comment. You just come pick it up. I'll leave the address below or something. You guys can come get it. We're going back to my house. Phew. How's it going, folks? Well, calm down a little bit. Okay. Had to take a little five minute breather, but we are back home. We are ready to go. And we got to go check on the chickens, see if they have any eggs laid. Because a lot of them have actually been, been laying in the afternoon, which is weird. Because I always thought they like, I thought they like laid them in the morning or like late at night or something. Is it weird to lay them in the afternoon? I feel like it is. That's what I thought. So, I don't know. What are you, we got, you gonna place bets? How, How many? many? How many? Three and two of them are gonna be brown. One's gonna be blue. Apparently they I do just blue. wanted to know a number. Uh, it's gonna have a diameter of 14 centimeters and a uh, circumference of, um, what do you think? Two. Two, three. One. Zero, I guess I will go with. Open her up, Bonzo. Oh, we got three. Oh, I was right. And a teal hey, egg. I was exactly you right. You were right. You're welcome. Wow. Did you look in here prior to No, I did not. How did Bonzo know? Dude, that's insane. So that looks like two different chick. I mean, obviously different chickens. Yeah. And then that one's teal, dude. Yeah. That looks like, that's like an Easter egg. Three whole eggs in one afternoon. So I guess they're afternoon layers. I checked this morning. There's only one, so. Come on, chickens. Come on, little chickens. Here you go, buddy. Which one can you pick up and put on your shoulder, Bonzo? We should try that right now. All right, Bonzo. Oh my goodness, this is not a good idea. I don't like this. Oh my goodness. Oh! <laughs> Did it work for a minute? Did you let I mean, go of it? it? Yeah, I let go. Was oh, it was the other one? one? Was it the other one? It that one's no, 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 it was this guy. Let's try this one. You wanna go on Bonzo's shoulder? Oh, she's chill, man. You still want she... Oh, she doesn't like that. This thing's gonna kill me. You're okay. You're fine. It's gonna work. Don't, no, 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 no. It's gonna jump. It's jumping. <laughs> yeah, it kind of works. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what's up, buddy? Bonzo, get your butt over here. One of these, says, they said, will lay on their, oh, you sit on your shoulder. That They're not parrots. Oh! Oh my goodness. Oh, it's working. Don't jump. No, no, no. Chill. Oh, this one's working. Bro! <laughs> what's up, buddy? You okay? No, 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 don't, 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 don't. Oh, oh God, don't. Right, Dude, fine. that worked. It worked though. We gotta train them. Yeah, we need names mm -hmm. for all of them. We need one chicken nugget. That's, That's kind of funny. Which one do you want? That one looks like, like a chicken nugget. You want this one to be nugget? That one right there is chicken nugget. It's got like yellow feet. This nugget. nugget has yellow feet. Nugget's got yellow feet. Oh. All right, well Macy just named one. It's nugget. You guys need to name the rest. There you go. A little midnight snack. They did good. Lay three eggs. Well, four eggs technically. You gotta treat your chickens right. Nuggets in here. Oh yeah, that's Aww. nugget. A little nugget. Nugget. Oh yeah, brother. Lily! What's up, puppies? How's it going? Hi, hi. What's up? What's up, big girl? What's up, big girl? How you doing? How you doing? Oh, you are such a big girl now. Anyways, we're back home. The uh, 12 wheeled tank thing is still at the farm. Just ripped that thing. I need to get that thing fixed. If you guys have any suggestions, uh, you know, as to what's wrong, what could be fixed, you guys let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Also, maybe name that thing. I mean, it's got 12 wheels, so maybe something with that. I don't know if you can come up with anything. But if you guys name it, uh, maybe send you some duck gear or something, Guggen gear, whatever you guys want, if I pick your guys' name. I would like to name it, because I pretty much have names for everything else. So let me know what you guys think in the comments section down below. Hope you guys enjoyed today's Marketplace mission video. It was kind of um, it was a doozy. Literally drove eight hours today, and uh, well, I already broke it. Seems to be kind of the trend here whenever I buy items like that. But anyways, doing it for you guys, trying to get some content. We'll get it back up and run and hopefully take it into the pond, into the marsh, maybe not out of it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace.